what's up guys? I am so hyped. Hey guys, once again, it's HMK and I'm here to bring you a hyped news video flash whatever. Holy snap. So anyways, guys, if you don't know, I am a tremendous and impossibly huge fan of Banjo-Kazooie. That shit was my childhood. You understand? I believe, I, I consider Banjo-Kazooie a more favorite game to myself than uh, a Super Mario 64. I had that shit on the N64, Banjo-Kazooie, Banjo-Tooie. I even got that weird interquel on the GBA, on the Game Boy Advance or whatever. And then sadly, when Rare was sold off to Microsoft, I even got the remakes, the HD re-releases on the Xbox 360. I love Banjo-Kazooie and I really, really hate how they fucked it all up with nuts and bolts. But anyways. Technically, we're not really talking about Banjo Kazooie. We're talking about the minds behind Banjo Kazooie. If you guys didn't know, when Rare was sold off to Microsoft, you know, they did a lot of blunders and they played around with ideas with Rare and stuff. And a lot of people, a lot of core members of Rare weren't really happy of where the company was going within Microsoft. So they decided to, you know, split and defect or whatever. But recently, not too long ago, they came back together and formed a new company known as Platonic Games. And today, they finally started the Kickstarter for their brand new title, a spiritual successor to Banjo-Kazooie named Ukulele. But anyways, Ukulele was known as Project Ukulele, which was actually spelled as Ukulele, but now it is Ukulele, Yuka and Lele. And these are the two new protagonists of Ukulele. Yuka and Lele, kind of like, you know, Banjo-Kazooie. It even has the Yuka Lele like Banjo-Kazooie. So Yuka is the green chameleon and Lele is the purple bat. I'm not really entirely sure about their genders right now. Um, I don't know. So guys, from what I've seen with this game and what Platonic Games promises us, I am too hyped for this game because what they say is true. Platformers has been on the decline in recent years and you know back in the day when N64 was out when PlayStation was out those good old 90 days you know Platforming was a huge thing, but now it's been kind of like easing back up a lot of people's been getting into the action uh, Action adventure genre the action RPG genre uh, FPS sports so platforming has been kind of the low and low the only people that's been really keeping it alive are people like Super Mario and you know a lot of indie games here and there but ukulele shows so much prompts. Every time I look at the gameplay footage, I just get reminded of those good old days of Banjo Kazooie and the impressive mind of Grant Kirkhope, who was the sound designer and the music producer of Banjo Kazooie up uh, when he was part of Rare. Once again, he is doing sound design and um, music production for ukulele. And when I played that track of the jungle level beat. I was transported back to the 90s. Holy shit! Fucking Grand Coco, you're a fucking musical genius, bro. That shit just, oh my goodness. I was like on the verge of tears. Mm. The, but damn, the music sounds good, the game looks good. But, Playtime Games is a, like an own individual independent studio, it's not really backed by a production company yet. Hopefully, this will get some eyes going. But, uh, they plan to kickstart the game, and the kickstart is already gone. Is already started. You know, I had to check out some details before I made this video. And when I walked away, they're already like a quarter away from their first goal. Their first goal is 175,000 euros. Yes, they're marketing it by euros because they are a European developer. But of course, there's going to be um, uh, currency translators up on the Kickstarter, and you can translate your own. It's not that hard to do it. Google it, guys. Come on. So their their initial goal is 175,000 euros. Their highest goal is 1 million euros, which is a pretty penny. But like, if my number nine was able to bust through that shit, this is gonna bust through that shit. And I'm asking you guys. I already backed. I already backed this game like like twice. There are a lot of cool goodies if you back this game, including digital downloads, Steam downloads, um, console downloads, physical PC versions, uh, early access into the beta, early access into the demo, early access into demo plus. If you you know donate enough or if you uh, pledge enough money, 
You can actually be a character in the game. You can actually show ideas to the Platonic team. And the highest bracket is 5,000 euros, which you get to attend a VIP uh, concert, uh, orchestra concert for the game up in Germany. So, if you back this game, you can get a lot of good goodies. And, of course, if you back the game even in the lowest bracket, you get your name on the credit screen, which is cool. Now, I've already backed this game. I'm already getting my console download. That is... That is fucking... Yes. So, the highest bracket of million euros ensures the game will release day one on all systems. They're planning to release it on Steam, Windows, Linux, Wii U, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. Which is very, very cool. I'm glad that they're, you know, brought it out, but, you know, Wii U, that's where I'm going for it. Hell yeah. So, um, if you pledge to this game, it, you help Banjo-Kazooie live on in ukulele. This, this game looks fucking amazing, and sorry I couldn't show you any footage because one, the footage that, uh, that is on YouTube is through IGN and fuck those guys, but um, as soon as I get more uh, information about this game, I'm gonna cover the shit out of it, I'm gonna pull the shit out of it, it's crazy. Now when will this game release? Uh, so far according to the Kickstarter and according to when the prizes will be given out and some of the prizes of the Kickstarter is um, the game itself. Hopefully, if everything goes smooth, the game will be released in October 2016. So that's more of a year away from that. And I am, you know, whatever. I am hyped out of my ass for that shit. And I, I totally understand. They just started the Kickstarter, and I cannot wait to get this game. You know what? I might pledge that shit again just to get the demo early. You know, holy snap. This game looks amazing. If you are a fan of Benji Kazooie, you're going to be a fan of this. Guys, the Kickstarter link is in the uh, description box below. Go help kickstart ukulele. I am too hyped for this shit. I am hyped out of my mind. And you know I'm going to play the shit out of that game. That game is going to be all over my channel. You don't understand. You know, in all honesty, it's kind of sad to see Benji Kazooie go and like, and go like that. And the forefathers of Benji Kazooie had to leave you know, their prodigal son, but I am happy of the prospects of the new, and I am so hyped for ukulele, and I hope you are too, and if you are, don't forget to pledge to the Kickstarter. So, until next video about ukulele, I'm Nate Jim K, and I'll check you guys later.